Here are Jim Gilbert's nature notes for the third week of March. Red osier dogwood twigs look bright red, the veins of spring. Weeping willow twigs have a golden yellow glow. Short-tailed weasels are turning from their white winter coats to brown summer ones. Woodchucks that went into hibernation in October are now above ground. Bald eagles are active over the Mississippi River area of the Twin Cities. It takes four years plus a few months for a bald eagle to develop a full white head and tail. Jim Gilbert's species of the month is the mallard duck. The mallard is the main ancestor of most breeds of domesticated ducks and is probably the most abundant wild duck throughout most of the northern hemisphere. The adult male mallard is well known for its green head, rust brown chest, and white neck ring. The hen is a combination of browns and tans. They are primary vegetarians feeding from the surface and dabbling from deeper water with their hind ends in the air. They dabble with their feet for balance. Mallards feed on duckweeds, seeds from sedges and grasses, corn and acorns, though will also eat animal matter including snails, aquatic insects, and even fish. Their average lifespan in the wild is three to four years. Mm -hmm.